let's do a spread in my new work planner. Stay tuned. Hey y'all, welcome and welcome back to my channel, Planning Serenity, where we plan for serenity. My name is Jessica, and as mentioned, we are doing a quick spread in my work planner. Now, every time I say we're doing a quick spread, it ends up not being so quick. So hopefully <laughs> that is actually the case this time, and it is quick. So, um, I recently got a new planner for work only. So if you did not watch my last, I guess, work planner video, I don't know what I called it. <laughs> um, I am using the Ashley Digital Studio um, Workday Planner. Ironically, I love all of the templates in this planner because they uh, really cater to my specific job and what my needs are. However, as you can see, we are using a dotted line page. So um, let's just get started and I guess I'll kind of explain. I mean, there's no real true big explanation, <laughs> groundbreaking explanation. Um, but long story short, I'm making a spread for meeting notes. Um, I have a few meetings this week. Um, here I go about to use the keyboard and I have one right here. I just keep forgetting to turn. Um, get it ready before we get started. Um, I have a few meetings this week. Um, however, I have a really big one on Monday and I do need to have my own personal notes. Um, there will be someone taking notes in the meeting as well as um, we use an AI note taker so I can always go back. However, for myself, I will need um, my own meeting notes for like action items and important things that come up in it. And y'all know, I just can't do the old boring, like just write it down. Now I will say um, when I was using my, if you're new here, when I was using my Hello Gorgeous um, volume two planner by Kristen for work, um, it just wasn't working out. And I was trying to type my notes in there. Um, but that's just, it's just a little too much because I already have a MacBook Pro for work. I have big screen monitors and all that good stuff. So like adding another keyboard to that setup and trying to type and use the computer, like it was just too much. So um, obviously I'm completely done with pen and paper. However, I still want a place to be able to write down what I need to write down. Um, so um, that's essentially what we're doing here. And I think I, what works best for me is writing on I don't know how to explain it. Long story short, we're making a page for my meeting notes for a meeting that I have tomorrow. <laughs> so hopefully this gives you all some ideas um, for note taking or I don't know, but hopefully we have some fun today. Well, not hopefully we have some fun. We will have some fun. All right, let's see. So um, to start, I'm going to grab, let's see, I think that's all the text I need. No, I do need to put... Um, I think I need to put, I was going to put the day of, but I might put the week of because like I said, I do have quite a, here we go again, still getting good notes, used to good note six, so excuse me. Um, I do have quite a bit in few, quite a few meetings, so I may put the meeting notes for more than one meeting on this spread. So, um, all right, this is an issue I may have. I think like the links in this planner are going to make it a little difficult to paste pictures. Um it is easier to drag them over, but as y'all know, I don't do split screen. So as you can see, I'm trying to paste the picture and it's like clicking on all the links possible. So um, I'm going to, this is what I'm gonna do. In order to get these pictures over, what I'm gonna, this is something that we used in yesterday's spread, um, but what I'm gonna do is just put this here so I can paste um, and then grab what I pasted. It's hard to explain. I figured that out while I was finagling with this um, with this spread or with this planner earlier. Um, so yeah, there's that. All right, let's oopsies undo. Here we go with the sensitivity. All right, undo. There's a train going by. So excuse me if you can hear that. All right, oopsies. Y'all, y'all. I'm, I'm, I'm just ignore me. Okay, well, don't ignore me because I really want you to watch. But <laughs> all right, what am I trying to do? Move that text box with the lasso tool. Images is off. So why am I having an issue? All right, there we go. Okay, so we're going to move that. And then um, these are by Ashley Digital Studio, the same as the Workday Planner that I'm using. Um, 
And I'm just gonna grab this. I don't know what it is. Oh, here we go. All right, I can actually delete this now since we have this one, um, which is actually a part of the spread. I think I'm gonna blow this up and then put meeting notes over it. Now, if you're new here um, or new to digital planning, when you bring images in, they do come in blurry, but when you click out, they go clear just as you saw. Let's um, just put this like right over here. Hmm, I don't know, here, actually, I'm like here, like you're here. Let's undo that because I actually wanna put it over. So we're gonna cut it and then the links in, I'm, I'm gonna need to figure, if, if y'all have any suggestions or if you're not new to, well, I mean, even if you are new, you may know this tidbit, but um, if y'all see the issue that I'm having and you have any suggestions or a workaround for that, please let me know. Um, I'm gonna delete that now because we don't need it. Let's cut this. We're gonna have to cut it because that, um, we pasted that, oops, here we go again. We pasted that after. So let's go here and then we're gonna paste meeting notes back and then just throw it up there in the corner. I do think I kind of want it hanging off that leaf like that. So that's cute. And then we're gonna go back to the impact font again, but let's turn it to white and let's bump it up to, that should be good. And then we're just gonna put weak, actually, that might be too big. Uh, all right, there we go. And then we're gonna make sure it's centered. Whoa, don't need it that big. Well, I guess it doesn't matter because we're resizing it. All right, so we're gonna put week of, and then enter um, 11 through 17. All right, so we have that. And now let's grab that and resize it. Um, and just throw it right there on the side. I think I did something similar to that in a recent spread. So, you know, just carry over ideas, y'all, if y'all can't figure out what to do. Um, so if you are new here, um, the reason I already know what stickers I wanna use is before I get on camera and uh, plan a spread with you all, I just go through and favorite the stickers that I think I wanna use. Um, so those were from Ashley Digital Studio. These, these are the stickers by the controversial company and if you're returning you know um well controversial sticker shop i guess you can say if you're returning you know who i'm referring to but this is the company where i will not say where they are from out loud but i'll just in case i'll put them down below um yeah i don't want to go through the whole explanation again so we'll just leave it at that now i think Hmm. I want to put like I still want to write on the dot grid, which is why I'm using this like picture frame. And as you saw, I just cropped it down to make it a square instead of a picture frame, because I still want to write on the dot grid my hand my handwriting instead of typing, as mentioned. <laughs> so, um, but I think I want like I want to put them all over, but I think I want this to go under here. So what we're gonna have to do is cut this. And then I think I'm getting the hang of like clicking on another photo just to paste on this dot grid. But I don't know, like, is that the case with all dot grid or is it the hyperlinks in this planner? Oopsies, I meant to cut that. Oopsies, all right, let's go back to it. All right, cut. Oops, let's click a picture and then paste and then bring it over here. Okay, cool. I think I like that there. Now let's copy this one and let's paste, I don't know, let's like, maybe actually let's, oops, this is crooked. Did I make that crooked? No, I didn't. Let's make this one smaller. I think to size these will be a lot easier when I bring in um, the other things that I have favorited. So let's just throw maybe three on the screen because again, there will be notes taken like on the screen and all that good stuff, but I do need my own notes, but I don't need to like have a whole page of notes, which is another reason why I'm doing this. Okay, let's go to, so the girls um, and the design that I'm using is R by Shishka Shop. Um, I have not used these girls with you all yet. 
Y'all know I have probably used like a hundred digital stickers by Shishka Shop planning with you all. However, I have not used this set yet. Um, oopsies. And reason being is because it's a newer purchase. Um, as of, I don't know, maybe like three weeks ago. I just haven't, I don't know. I just haven't brought them out, y'all. I'm They're absolutely gorgeous and kind of intimidating. And I hope I do them justice. But again, um, I've been really into like landscape, not landscape, scenes lately and like creating scenes that'll make me want to jump in my planner. Um, but again, this is technically a meeting notes page, so I can't do too much, but I hope I'm still doing these stickers justice. Um, and I don't even know if the camera's doing them justice because these stickers are absolutely drop dead gorgeous. Okay. So we have this, um, I don't want to pronounce this wrong. It is a Paris, um, a black girl in Paris kit though. Um, if you can't tell by, you know, the girls, but it's also black girl coffee. Pa I don't know. I don't know what it is, but they are by Shishka Shop. I always put the shops that I'm using down below in the description. So I did favorite another sheet from this set because I wanted to use a girl from this page. This is her. Um, I will have my coffee bright and early Monday morning um, and I will be sitting <sighs> for this meeting and I'm not going to say this is how I feel about it, but <laughs> this is so appropriate for a work spread, which is why I favorited her. Um, and she the background of these stickers are actually oh, they're so gorgeous you can't really see it on white paper um so i definitely will be reusing this set on a black page i can only imagine what it looks like on a black page but um i do think that for my work um notes it'll be best to start out with um a black pen so for instance obviously this isn't my handwriting but um i do write fairly small so i may be able to fit two lines within these dot grids um two lines of handwriting um but this is essentially what my notes is going to look like that's the that's the idea um and the way my brain works is organized chaos hence why i don't like i can't just pull up a notes page and just write line by line by line like that will literally drive me nuts um so this works out a lot well for me because i my brain is organized chaos so my notes will be neat and arranged in sections but i hope you understand what i'm trying to say so as y'all know i always have to use stickers by kristen in every single spread so i have her sticker book pulled open and this is the one that i favorited this time it says she has a fire inside her a burning desire to complete the vision and um i'm pretty much using this because as y'all can see it's typewriter font which is my fave type of text box sticker and then also um i really want to use my work planner to the best of like i don't know what's the word use my work planner the way it needs to be used y'all know i struggled when i would did my work planner in my hello gorgeous so i really want this to work out for me um so yeah we need to complete the vision of our work planner essentially now i just made this a little bit bigger and i do think i copy and pasted these boxes which means that won't be the same size so actually let me see because this does look yeah that is smaller huh so i can make this one bigger um but as y'all know i say follow me on instagram at planning serenity not to get more followers but because this is what i do afterwards i just play around with the sizing of things sometimes i add stuff sometimes i don't um, but I always post the final product on my Instagram page. But I think this is good. Again, this is for work. I can't do too much. But, you know, I like a little... Oh, I love it. 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 I really, really love how this turned out. If you are new here and you made it to the end of this video, please drop a black heart or a white heart in the comments just so I know that you're new, you made it to the end, and you like what you're seeing. If you do like what you're seeing, a like and subscribe would be absolutely awesome. If you're returning, please drop our butterfly in the comments just so I know that you're not going anywhere. You're not upset with me for switching to digital. And other than that, I will see all of y'all in my next next video. Bye!